What's good, YouTube? Napa 92 here, back again, once again. And tonight, people, tonight we are here for episode number 20 of Late Night Crystal. Late Night Crystal is a Pokemon Crystal randomized Nuzlocke here on the channel. If you missed out on the last episode, you guys, uh, we had blunders and flunders afoot, but we ended up making our way all the way through Victory Road, through Tojo Falls, of course, here to the Pokemon League, and in tonight's episode, which is an hour of chill, by the way, I don't know if anybody told you that, but if you didn't get the memo, I'm letting you know, tonight's episode is an hour of chill. Um, so we are going to be taking on the Pokemon League. So if you missed it on the last episode, definitely make sure you go back and check it out. And if you are hype for tonight's episode, or if you are chill, if you are relaxed for tonight's episode, and you'd like to show your support as a proud one of the Nappy Nation, make sure to like button down below for us because you already know support is greatly appreciated. Um, now, before we get into things, let's get a quick team recap. You like my boy sitting here next to me? Ah! You're challenging the Elite Four. Are you sure you're ready? If you need to train some more, my Abra can help you. It can teleport you home. Would you like to go home? No, bro, chill. Okay, okay, the best of luck to you. Okay, bye, see you. Uh, but yeah, anyways, my boy here. <laughs> best of luck, goodbye. Um, but we did go ahead and get the squad leveled up, and here I am slipping again. I don't know why I ever even planned to include shit. Uh, if I don't get it ready, um, I want to give a quick shout out. Um, I asked you guys in the last episode, last night's episode, what you think we should train up to for the Elite Four. Um, just want to give a quick shout out to my boy, uh, Bassam Pal. Um, he suggested 57, 57, 58, 58, 59, 59. So, uh, I suggested 60, 58, 55 or something like that 60 58 56 something like that Some, somewhere around there but i don't know i like i like that one i like the way that sounds i think it's pretty even pretty fair for us to go through so i chose two pokemon to be level 56 up first we have lady ramla our crow bat at level 56 holding the amulet coin rack and wing attack bite fly and confuse hooray up next, we have Winnie, our Ursa Ring at level 56, uh, sporting that polka dot bow, rocking strength slash cut and lick. Oh, look at that attack stat. Oh my goodness. Up next, at level 57, we have Julian, our shiny tentacruel. I love how balanced uh, his stats are. I just, I just love seeing all the numbers, all the numbers on the screen. Like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, but he's holding the Mystic Water, Rock and Surf, Acid Barrier, and Hydro Pump. He learned Hydro Pump by level up. Um, don't really have a TM to fill up that spot, so let's hope and pray that somewhere in Kanto, we find a TM for him. Bingo, bingo. Um, but it's Hydro Pump for now. It's Late Night Crystal. Why the fuck not? Hydro Pump's animation is dope as shit. Um, up next, we have Xavier, our level 57 Hypno. Look at that special. Um, he's holding a Twisted Spoon, rocking Psychic, Headbutt, Poison Gas, and Hypnosis. He tried to learn Psych Up, and I was like, bruh. Nah. Not right now. Nah. 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 I'm trying to avoid coughing my brains out. Up next, at level 58, we have Sauron, our Hound Doom. I decided to take him to level 58, because he has honestly proved himself through this LP. You know, I was really down to keep, uh... Roger our Charmeleon. Um, but I don't know. Maybe next time we'll end up with a Charizard. I feel like we just get so close and the Charizard just get ripped away from us. Not that I'm like a Charizard advocate, but I'm not like anti Charizard either. But you know, I don't know. I just feel like it's it's like a carrot dangling in front of us and we're just so close to it. But anyways, Sauron has done great. We love him. We love him. We love him. We love him. Special attack is off the charts. Um, I decided to raise him up to one of our level 58s because he's quick and he hits hard. And if even if he has a glass cannon, all we need to do is click flamethrower. And as long as you aren't a swampert, you're dying to his flamethrower. He's holding a charcoal. He's holding a charcoal. <laughs> but he is holding a charcoal rock and flamethrower crunch psychic and faint attack. And you guessed it. Last but not least, 
at level 58 we have Judy the ride on uh, she's holding her quick claw rock and stomp horn attack horn drill and fissure um, I was sitting here thinking damn well 58 <laughs> isn't it like 65 or something like that till she gets earthquake like god damn I guess somewhere in the back of my mind this entire time I just assumed that once we got to this point in the game we'd have earthquake but damn we still ain't there yet <laughs> Judy, come on, what's going on here? Um, but yes, I decided to take Ramla and Winnie to 56 because I feel like Winnie is bulky enough to take a hit and hit back strong enough. Um, Ramla, I feel like her speed is going to be most beneficial. I'm pretty sure that she's still the fastest one in the party. 182, she's 100 points of speed faster than Winnie. Jesus. 144, 97, 141. 85 so um not that i don't want her to hit harder or anything like that but i'm just saying like her best stat is speed so i feel like she doesn't need to be the highest because she will still be the fastest you see, you see, you see, you see i'm picking up what i'm putting down um julian i feel like it's never a bad thing to count out your water type water types the most abundant they're always there and name a time that you played through pokemon when your water type was not there for you name it name it <laughs> you know i mean i know sometimes playing a nuzzle like shit happens but most of the time my water type is always my most dependable on the squad so i figured if i had to have someone in the middle let's drop julian off right there xavier i wanted to have up here because i really wanted to have a decent special wall um xavier's offensive capabilities aren't the world's wildest but it's okay i would rather have bulk even if i need somebody to send out there and just heal up or whatever you know xavier is there to do the damn thing sauron like i said he's really impressed the shit out of me i want somebody fast i want somebody to hit hard that's sauron and judy kind of the same reason as xavier you know we could have swapped judy and xavier in this place i just wanted somebody that was defensive that could take hits bada bang bada boom so i'm gonna shut the fuck up now and go play some pokemon so Let's go do it. <laughs> it's an hour of chill. It's an hour of chill. What, what, what even is an hour of chill when our main series on the channel is an hour long episode every single day? <sighs> What's up, bro? <laughs> Welcome to the Pokemon League, Nappy. Allow me to introduce myself. <laughs> I'm Will. I have trained all around the world, making my psychic Pokemon powerful. At last, and at last, I've been accepted into the Elite Four. This is where he, like, pushes his glasses up and he goes, Sheen! Speaking of Sheen, uh, is this ice? Is this supposed to be, like, the same room Lorelei was in? Is that why it's icy? Right? Makes sense, right? Did I just answer my own question? So I was gonna say, are these supposed to be like mirrors? Because he's a psychic type? Like, or is this just so hot and fresh? You know, like Lorelai just left 36 hours ago, 48 hours ago. They ain't got time to change the room yet. But uh, come on, it's still all icy. They just, they just cut the AC off. Now it's melting. I can only keep getting better. Losing is not an option. Who are we leading with? Rama. Ooh, we boy. Technician Pansy wants to battle. Alright, Technician Pansy, send out that Azumarill. Look at how thick this Pokemon is. Oh my god. Why is it so wide? <laughs> you know what, Azumarill? It's 2023. You live your best life. Just don't come near me with no ice type moves. Or rock type moves either. I'm not a fan of those either. Okay, so check it. You're locked into rollout, right? Right? You're locked into rollout when you use rollout. So, as long as we don't miss the Don fan in the room, we should just be able to stomp the shit out of this Zoom <laughs> Hey, the Don fan is still wreaking havoc. That's fine with me. That's fine with me. 
That's fine with Judy too. Judy, do your thing. Do your thing, Judy. Do your thing, girl. Do your thing. Look at that. Judy's so strong she takes out water types. Come on. Technician Pansy gonna send out a marrow white. Whoa, 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 whoa. Who told you to do all that? Romla, come on back out, girl. Watch this marrow white go for a boomerang and do nothing. Uh, can I click bite on you? <laughs> How did you end up in the Elite Four, bruh? With a rage Marowak. Who did you spook? I don't like Whoa, 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 whoa. Joe, 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 Joe. Okay, the, actually, you know what? That don't do shit to us. We don't care about that. Hurt yourself with confusion. Oh, I meant to open up the gorgeous box and the normal box. Praise the brick piece. I'm sorry. It's like how Arya had the, like, uh, her list. I meant to get four stores, too. Fuck. Yo, hurt yourself one more game. <laughs> I'll take it, bro. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Can I just take the moment to say, isn't it wild that we're at the D4 right now? Like, I feel like, like we just did Renegade Platinum. And like, I know that Platinum's a longer game than first and second gen. But like we just did Renegade Platinum, right? And we did Late Night Yellow, did the Elite Four, and dove right into Late Night Crystal. And we just finished the Elite Four of Renegade Platinum, and now here we are at the fucking Elite Four again. These motherfuckers can't get enough of us. Holy shit. Yo, that's crazy in general, and Raichu has nothing against a right on. A duck tree? Yo, what the fuck is up with this? Every time I be sending something out, I'd be killing something that you have, and then you send out some random ass Pokemon. Uh, does the trio get Stone Edge? <laughs> hey, ain't nobody falling for this stupid shit again, bro. I'm flying up out of here. Show me what you got. Sand Attack? That wouldn't hit me either. That still would fail. Is that why that Marowak clicked Rage? <laughs> Sand Attack does hit me. Oh, my accuracy. Slash, get out of here. Rama still outspeed you. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh my god. Why does this keep happening to me? <laughs> always this fucking Pokemon. Yeah. Miss that shit. Hold the strength. Winnie, you got this. If there's any Pokemon on our team that can leverage a Snorlax, it's definitely Winnie. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't be clicking on rollout. Don't do it. Don't you be doing it. I'm not interested. Hey, can we get a round of applause for Winnie? That Snorlax is level 55. Um, we're actually like right on par, smack dab, perfect. Technician Pansy, out of my way. I I can't believe it. 11 grand. Shout out to the Lady of the Reach. Shout out to the Lady of the Reach. Even though I was defeated, I will change my course. I will continue battling until I stand above all trainers. Now, Navi, move on and experience the true ferocity of the Elite Four. Hush. Hush. Should we open the gorgeous box? No, we're gonna wait. We're gonna wait. We're gonna wait until we have our Elite Four Championship and this will be our prize. The normal box and the gorgeous box. You know, I meant to get fucking four restores. <sighs> Mighty brick piece, how I fail you. Um, okay, so let's see here. Let's see here, let's see here, let's see here, let's see here. We have leftovers. And two scope lenses. I feel like we're not utilizing our items properly. We have scope lenses. Should we put a scope lens on Sauron? Um, should we put a scope lens on Sauron and give up his charcoal? Um, we really don't have any little means to heal, so I'm not going to waste any Podions right now. But, I mean, I feel like we could spare it. Like, it wouldn't hurt us. Um, hold up. Do we got any, uh... No? Okay. Fuck it. Why not? Do I do this? Do I heal 17 points of damage? 
on Winnie with a hyper potion. Oops, I did. Oops, I did. Oops, I did. Whoa, holy fuck. It's popping, bro. Look kind of familiar. I am Goga of the Elite Four. I live in shadows of Ninja. My ink jacket style will confound and destroy you. Confusion, sleep, and poison. Prepare to be the victim of my sinister technique. Ka -ka 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 -ka. Pokemon is not merely about brute force. You shall see soon enough. Watching my whole squad of legendary Pokemon. Alright, Technician Sonya. Instead of Elite Four, they're Technicians. I'm not mad at that terminology. Fuck. But he's a Steel type in this generation, which means he gets what? What's the, the Flash Cannon? Is Flash Cannon a thing in this generation? Um, what can I do to this here Steel type? I can. Is it Sauron? I think we're always gonna lead with, uh. You don't affect the Dark Lord with fucking Thunder Waves. Get the fuck out of here. Um. I think we're always gonna leave with Ramla. She's got the Ramla coin. Why the fuck not? <laughs> Why the fuck not? Why the fuck will we not? Get this Magneton out of here, bro. How do they promote you? Eradicate? Eradicate? They promoted you with Eradicate? Did you fill that out on your application? I know they had to ask, like, name, date of birth, height, weight, eye color. Social security, and then they had to at some point look at that. <sighs> Put a scope lens on Sauron. No, we don't. They had to ask you, like, hey, what six Pokemon would you be utilizing? <laughs> right, <that kid. laughs> Oh, yeah, get that guy. Bring him in. Hey, Sauron, the Dark Lord, he is here. So 57 is the highest I've seen Koga with. Oh my good. Is this what the computer feels like in Renegade Platinum? <laughs> Is this what the computer feels like in Blaze Black 2? Oh, this is just no way. There's no way. No, this must this must not be what the computer feels like, because this guy's not nuzlocking. <laughs> He would not have sent out a Butterfree against fucking Houndoom. Oh wow, now I know what it feels like to be the computer. God damn. Sauron, two crits in a row, Sauron. God damn, a mischievous? Oh my goodness. I think just from this one battle alone, I think Kogan needs to be removed. <laughs> I, at this point, I should take his place. <laughs> Whether I'm cheating or not, he should most definitely be removed. If you are an Elite Four member and you can get your whole team wiped with one Pokemon, <laughs> oh, you have proven your worth. I gotta calm down. We're being too loud. Late night, late night, Crystal. I subjected you to everything I could muster, but my efforts failed. I must hone my skills. Go on to the next room and put your abilities to test. I think this is the part of the video where we should take a brief moment and read from our pocket Maya Angelou wisdom. We just started chapter two yesterday and our second quote of chapter two, love, is love recognizes no barriers. It jumps hurdles, leaps fences, penetrates walls, to arrive at its destination full of hope. Love recognizes no barriers. It jumps hurdles, leaps fences, penetrates walls to arrive at its destination full of hope. You know, that reminds me of a saying that I have always said in life um, in regards to the people around you. If somebody wants to do something they will do it if you are committed to somebody or if you are friends with somebody or this or that or whatever and you 
express to them that you are lacking something or you need something or uh, some change needs to occur um, and they aren't willing to meet you there then that tells you a lot just in that one moment um, but they could turn around and go and do this or that or the other or whatever but the point I'm making is if somebody truly loves you for who you are for what you bring to the table for what you bring to the relationship you know to whatever degree that this format applies people will move mountains to do the things they need to do look at crackheads <laughs> they will get shit done because they want that next fix you know I know that's a goofy comparison but that's the idea that she's conveying you know somebody really wants to do something in life they will do it they will get it done you will see what their priorities are but remember the same applies to you you know uh, the other people in your life the other people in your relationship are seeking the same thing so it's it's an interesting like I was gonna say the word dimension but that's the wrong word to go about it um, it's an interesting perspective. What the fuck? Why can't I think of the most simple word? Interesting perspective to think about because, you know, always put yourself in someone else's shoes. Before you snap, before you go off or whatever, just, just ask yourself, like, was this from a place of malice? Did this person that loves me intentionally do this or that or whatever? But this is, this is, it's too broad of a... statement you know to really like speak about it I feel like it's a, it's a broad statement that applies to individual situations and then you go from there but you get the overall point I'm trying to make you know let me right damn you my angel getting too deep well we said we need to chill it out so chilled it out anyways our next person to get their ass handed to him I am brutal of the elite four, brother. I always train to the extreme because I believe in our potential. That's how we become strong. Can you withstand our power, brother? Hmm. I see no fear in you. You look determined, perfect for battle. Ready, brother. You will bow down to our overwhelming power. <laughs> Come on, bro. Let's get it on. Let's get it on tonight. Technician Stacy wants to battle. All right, Stacy. Ooh, the Gyarados. We're starting at level fifty-five now. Okay, okay, okay. Um, a spooky, spooky Gyarados. What do we do against the spooky Gyarados? I think we're going to. Uh, set up a barrier. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I had Sludge Bomb. Um, I think we're gonna go out to. I know he gets bite. I'm gonna go out to. Uh, I don't really know what to do here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Fuck it. I'm just gonna go to my gut. Rain dance? Make it rain, ho. Make it rain all you motherfucker want. Check out this barrier. Now, I don't know about you, but most of the time when motherfuckers do this shit, I forget about it. But, Hydro Bomb? In the rain? It's not very effective, bro. Here, watch. Check it. I'll do it too. Ooh, I did more than you. <laughs> Ooh, Twister, so he has Hydro Pump, Rain Dance, Twister, and I'm hoping Bite. Oh, I need Sludge Bomb so badly. Oh my god, Hydro Pump did more. <laughs> oh my goodness, is this enough to kill? not bite yo I literally tapped the speed up button for not even 
a fraction of a second and we missed one of the best moves in the game crazy get rid of this dude come on Julian you got this what is the irony of Julian our shiny tentacruel taking out a Gyarados a normal Gyarados when we got the shiny Julian the tentacruel I'm a shiny Gyarados fortress yo we're not doing this I've learned my lesson I've learned my lesson trust me I don't like it I don't like it I don't like it <laughs> I don't like it, I don't like it, I don't like it. I'm not messing with it, I'm not touching it. Look, is he going to hit me back? With Bide? I landed the horn drill finally. Is he gonna like live and then click Bide and hit me back with double the damage? He's <laughs> gonna kill two of my Pokemon. <laughs> Open up my bags and Winnie is gone. Oh no. Who you got next? The Sea King? Oh no. Don't waterfall me. See, this is what I was talking about when I said you always gotta rely on your water types. Because now look. Here comes this jackass. Um I know he gets oh I don't wanna say it. I'm not gonna say it out loud. Fuck yeah. Talk your shit, Julian. Shit. You hear that? Letting everybody know. Look at me. I'm here. Look at me. I wish uh, Sheer Cold a thing in Gen 2? I feel like it's definitely a thing in Gen 3. But is it a thing in Gen 2? Um, reason that I ask is because can Julian learn it? <laughs> That's all I really want to know. Can we add more one hit KO moves? To our squad please and thank you not very effective god damn Julian rack them points go ahead you got two more Pokemon whoa 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 that's a low blow 56 but 57 was the highest we saw right Zaron can you handle this bro <laughs> what do I mean can you handle this Whoa, 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 I forgot about them spikes, too. I thought that was last battle. Whoa. Yo, we're not... Oh, I forgot the fucking color stores. Who needs evasion? When you can burn everything to the ground. Go right ahead. Click the buttons that you want. Make fun of my lost victory bells. It's not my fault. Level 60, yo, this Magmar though. Yo, we might need to get a Magmar on the team. I mean, Sauron, you're doing excellent things. You're doing excellent things. Yo, I don't like this. Okay, Confuse Ray, chill, 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 chill. Okay, so you click your Confuse Ray all you want. Oh, sunny day, that's gonna be a problem. Come to your senses, Julian. And absorb this fire blast like the nothing that it is. Hydro pump him in the sun. Show him the power you were born with. My child. <sighs> Only reason you live that. You know, I'm not doing this. Get this shit out of here, bro. Look at look what you're doing. Look at what you're doing. Look at what you're doing. Look at what you're doing. Imagine if I hadn't done that. Why did I click Hydro Pump? <laughs> Doesn't matter. Jillian's got this. I was gonna say, imagine if I hadn't healed, went for the Hydro Pump, missed, and then he Fire Blasted me, and I lost a Shiny Tentacruel to Fire Blasting Magmar in the sun. Yikes. Anyways. Three Elite Four members down. Can we get a finger snap for the team here, please? Why? How could we lose, brother? Yo, Ramla is making us a very rich Pokemon trainer. Having lost, I have no right to say anything. Go face your next challenge. Okay. Cool with that. Keep that mouth shut. Cool with that, bro. Go ahead. 
Okay, so Ramla, Lady of the Reach. Oh, I forgot about Karen. I am Karen of the Elite Four. Your nappy? How amusing. I love dark type Pokemon. I find their wild, tough image to be so appealing, and they're so strong. Think you can take them? Just try to entertain me. Let's go. Technician Pansy. Oh my god. Why do you keep doing this to me? Why do you keep doing this to me? I'm gonna click Confuse Ray on this large fella here. Okay, 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 okay. I won't forget about the dime pad. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Keep doing it, keep doing it, keep doing your thing. Hurt yourself with confusion and flinch. Get him out of here. Who's next? <laughs> I wasn't gonna sit there and let that Snorlax do anything. Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay, I know we still have three to go, but level 59 for alligator. So far she has a Snorlax and a for alligator. Am I loving her team? Yes, absolutely. Hey, we just did the whole Hydro Pump thing. I ain't scared of it. Why are you screeching? So you can click slash. Watch me hydro pump you, bitch. Oh, I called him on it. What do I do here? I'm gonna take the slash on Winnie. Scary face. I thought he was gonna go for a hydro pump. We got an ether and elixir. Never had any doubt, in motherfucking Winnie the Ursa Ring. Took that hydro pump to the face, and she came back up, wrung out her polka dot bow. I was like, let's go, bitch. Tackled that get it to the ground. Snatched his mouth open and shoved that boulder right inside. Yeah, Mac, why? Yo, she's got the best Elite 14. Best Elite 14 I've ever seen in my life. Hands down. Um, Xavier, I'm gonna need you to hold this one down. Is this his debut in the Elite Four? Yo, Xavier. Perfect. 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 Everyone. Whoa, 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 whoa. That flamethrower did a lot of damage. All right, now check this out. Check this out. No, all your shit's failing, bitch. Check this out. You want to click that flamethrower? I'm going to click this psychic. How you feel about that? Whoa, 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 whoa. We still did more, bro. We still did more. No, 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 no reason for that. I think they should make that the default Confuse Ray animation in every Pokemon game from here on out. Imagine if you were playing Legends Arceus and the screen went like inverted and the Confuse Ray went across the screen. <laughs> Just imagine. <laughs> Just for a moment. Yo, I'm not a fan of this. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I'm not a fan of this. Sunlight got bright and we're going to start clicking... Fire Blast and Flamethrower. Oh my goodness. Okay, chill. Wait, time out. Siren, it's gotta be you, bro. Yo, I'm... Stop! I do the Confuse Ring here. Accuracy fell? Guess what, bitch? Bantai never misses! Came through the smoke. Came through the smoke. Oh, come on. Sauron. You were born in the fire. Excellent work. Keep it up. Keep it the fuck up. Get, get the Magmar out of here. She's got two Mons left. She has the best Elite Four team I've ever seen. Azumarill. <sighs> Level 61. Fuck. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, our team is not prepared for this at all. Ramla, you might have to carry for a moment. Oh my goodness. Ramla, I need you to take a hit. Oh my god, he doesn't go for anything crazy. Okay, wait, wait, wait. He 
He's locked in. Oh my god, he's locked in. Okay, I have to pay attention. I have to pay attention. I have to pay attention. We still have horn attack. I have to pay attention. We don't necessarily want him to flinch either. I would rather take the rollout. Rain stop. Fuck yeah. I can't believe we outspeed this Azumarill either. <laughs> Judy, go ahead. Shit. I see you. The oh my god. Technician Max. Or oh, Technician Pansy use a Max Potion. Oh my god. Wait. Does it tell you when it's no longer locked into rollout? Never tells you when they're no longer locked into rollout. <sighs> Judy. I feel like our wall has fallen. And I'm so very sad that it was Judy. <sighs> I fucking love right on. Oh my god. Should have thought about that. The moment I saw the Max Potion, I should have thought about that. <sighs> Julian. Get us out of here, bro. Is he a fairy type in this game? Stop fucking rolling out. What is every Pokemon in this game? And she has an Entei. Okay, well, Azumarill's not the worst Pokemon. You know, I shit talk that Azumarill. <laughs> I was talking about how good the rest of her team is. And I was like, Azumarill, mm, well, she already had for Alligator. She already had Water type, which is honestly my only grievance with it. But that Azumarill just... Take it to heart. Take it to heart. But I would still say she probably still does have the best Elite Four team I've seen so far. That makes me so sad. Judy's passing makes me so sad. And then you use Stomp. Judy's signature fucking move. She never even got to Earthquake. Fuck you, pansy. Well, aren't you good? I like that in a trainer. Strong Pokemon, weak Pokemon. That is only the selfish perception of people. Truly skilled trainers should try to win with their favorites. I like your style. You don't understand what's important. Go on, the champion is waiting. <laughs> oh, my break peace. How could you let this happen, almighty brick piece? Judy is gone. Yo, her team is kind of rocked in that battle. Okay, 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 okay. We're back up and running. I want to check out Judy. I'm sorry. I'm going to take this from you just for now. Let me see. Excuse me. Let me see what... You got plenty of flamethrowers for this. You're good. You're good. We need you taken care of. You're good. You're good. Okay. So it's just Julian. Ah, okay. Here. Here, 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 here. So you need surfs and hydro pumps. Well, alright, ladies and gentlemen. It is time. 
Oh, don't tell me this is some automatic shit. All right. It is time. I'm going to save my game because only you can prevent lost save data. <sighs> Judy, 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 Judy. <sighs> my save state as well. Oh, that hurts my heart. It hurts my heart so much. <sighs> I've been waiting for you, Neffy. I knew that you with your skills would eventually reach me here. There is no need for words now or music. We will battle to determine who is the stronger of the two of us. As the most powerful trainer and as the Pokemon League champion, I, Lance, the Dragon Master, accept your challenge. He's selling DVDs, bro. Look at this cape. Designer Bob. <laughs> it's not a knockoff. Look. <laughs> All right, Designer Bob. Oh, this is how we doing it? Is this like some weird like Black Mirror plot twist where he's got my entire team identical? Let's see who's Crobat's faster. You know, I feel like whenever I zone out, this is the song that plays in my head, just like this. What? <laughs> it just plays like that in my head. Check it out. His crowbar's not touching me. I know your crowbar don't know fly. Don't get it by level up. Hurt yourself. <laughs> get this crowbar out of here. Get this crowbar out of here. Get it out. Be gone. Be gone. Hurt yourself again. Just once. Mean look. Where the fuck am I supposed to go, bro? If I ain't swapped out by now, I ain't never swapping out. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Hurt yourself again. Yo, how did you become champion? How? You might be champion, but Lady Ramla is Lady of the Reach, and she will take the doubloons from your pocket. Give them to her. Designer Bob with the mischievous. Hey, don't be doing no level 61. Don't be doing the shit I think you're gonna be doing. You know, I'm looking out for the destiny bond here. I'm looking out for it. It hasn't happened in a long, 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 long time, but oh fuck, I forgot you know side beat Rob. Hold up, 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 hold up. Hold strong, hold strong, hold strong, Rob. Yes, fuck yes. Okay, we're not playing with this shit. I'm gonna fuck with Lady Ramla. You're gonna end up bringing out the Dark Lord. And this mischievous won't know what hit it. You better hope and pray that you break. I was gonna say, you better hope and pray. Too bad you trapped the wrong one. You got a little excited from that side beam. You thought that was gonna be it. You thought that was gonna be it. I don't think so. Lady Ramla does not go anywhere without the Hound. <laughs> oh, I gotta calm down. Lady Ramla and Sauron, the Hound over here. Okay, designer Bob, who you got next? I'm a champ. Yo, I already know what's gonna happen. Lady Ramla, I need you to take this hit. Actually, no, Julian, you could take it. Julian resists as well. And I can set up a barrier too. Yeah, I knew you was gonna go for that cross job, bitch. Check this out. Check this out. Check it out. I'm not gonna remember it's there, so I know you won't stress about it being there. But hold this hydro pump, bro. I, I gotta say, for a champion's team, he's got a pretty good fucking squad. I will say that much. He really does. Oh, chill with the cross chops, bro. I don't know if you know this, but Tentacruel Julian over here is a boy. I guess the fucking berry doesn't matter if that's the case. Fuck, yo, I'm not risking this shit. This is a fucking shiny tentacle. How many times on this channel do you see us use legal shiny Pokemon? <laughs> it almost never fucking happens. We never do it in those likes. I'm not losing this bitch now. 
Get the fuck out of here. That would be the time that I would miss the hydro pump. I miss the fucking hydro pump. He would get land the cross chop and it would kill. Nah. Not happening. Not happening. <sighs> Who you got left, bro? Three more Pokemon. Damn. A lady in. I take back everything I said about his team. Take it all back right now. Check this out. Isn't Lady in like specially defensive though? Isn't that, like the only decent stat it has? Yeah. He ate that pretty good. And watch this double edge do nothing. <laughs> Take back everything I said about Lance's team. Get the fuck out. Get the fuck out. Oh, bro, there's no way. He had two of our own Pokemon. What do I do against an Ursaring? Judy has left us. Oh, Judy. I wish I can go out to Winnie, but um, who's got the better defense? Y'all tell me. Wanna wait? Shitting me. <laughs> I'm gonna click Hydro Pump. I mean, I know I'm gonna outspeed this thing, but what is it gonna do? Hit me with Slash? It's gonna hit me hard. I, I don't expect to kill this Earth Ring with this Hydro Pump. Oh my god. Just fucking Hyper Beam me, bro. <laughs> hey, actually, I think this barrier is saving us. Does the barrier ever go down? Is it permanent? If it said it went down, I missed it. But if it's permanent, then that first ring never stood a chance, bro. I told you I was going to forget about the barrier. <laughs> His last Pokemon? Oh my god. Did he have two Mischievous on his team? Is that because he has two Dragonites? <laughs> his little 65 Mischievous? And I'm all out of Hydro Pulse? What the fuck am I supposed to do? Well, Sauron. It's time. It's level 65, Mischievous. Lock us in. Can't escape now. I ain't trying to go nowhere else. This is his highest level Pokemon versus our highest level Pokemon. I wonder what will happen next. Yeah. I can't be similar strength. Maybe I didn't check that shit. How the fuck is Dragonite swapped out for a Mischievous? Or, yeah, Mischievous. Designer Bob. <laughs> Fucking knockoff champion over here. <laughs> it's over. <laughs> but it's an odd feeling. I'm not angry that I lost. In fact, I feel happy. Happy that I witnessed the rise of a great new champion. Damn. Whew. You have become truly powerful, Nappy. Your Pokemon have responded to your strong and upstanding nature. As a trainer, you will continue to grow strong with your Pokemon. <laughs> oh my god, like, oh no, like, it's all over. Professor Oak, if you weren't so old, ugly, and slow. <laughs> oh, Nappy. It's been a long while. You certainly look more impressive. Your conquest of the league is just fantastic. Your dedication, trust, and love for your Pokemon have made this happen. Your Pokemon were outstanding too, because they believed in you as a trainer. They persevered. Congratulations, Nappy. Oh my god, like, let's get this inter let's interview the brand new champion. This is getting to be a bit too noisy. Nappy, could you come with me? Oh my god, like, oh, wait, we haven't done the interview. Damn, it has been a while since, you know, I mean, I know we saw him at the start of this game, but I feel like we saw him at the start of Blade Night Yellow. <laughs> and now he's here in a second region to see his cool with all of me. <laughs> I feel like Professor Oak should come back at the Hall of Fame ceremony for every single game. <laughs> I remember you. It's been a long time since I last came here. This is where we honor the League Champions for all eternity. The courageous Pokemon are also inducted. Here today, tonight, 
we witness the rise of a new league champion, a trainer who feels compassion for and trust toward all Pokemon, a trainer who succeeded through the perseverance and determination, the new league champion who has all the makings of greatness. Nappy, allow me to register you and your partners as champions. Hey, what can I say? Rest in pieces. Rest in peace, Judy. Check out Lady Ramla, Lady of the Reach. Winnie, our Ursaring. Ooh, look at her go. She's like, yeah. Tell me how good I am. I know, I know. Everyone doubted Julian. But Julian, our tentacle, actually did a lot in the, the Pokemon League. Look at Xavier, our Hypno, coming through. Eating them hits like he ought to do. And, you know, you gotta say, you gotta give it up for, like, honestly, the real MVP of the uh, Pokemon League here. Sauron. <sighs> Memorial. Judy R. Rhydon. All my fault. So upset about that. So, so upset about that. 234 Pokemon seen. 49 Pokemon owned. 24 million playtime hours. You need to fill up the Pokedex, catch different kinds of Pokemon. I'm fucking Nuzlocke in here, bro. Can't do that shit. Well, I'd like to give a special shout out to the Pokemon Crystal version staff. <laughs> um, anyways, we have made it through the Pokemon League. Fuck yeah, we did it. Hot damn. I really did not want to lose any Pokemon in that, but... <sighs> what was that, like the third, fourth time we were counting up rollouts? And I don't know, I just, I guess the max potion threw me off, but the moment I saw the max potion, I should have known, like, oh, rollout's not done, I didn't kill it in time, whatever, but, rest in peace, Judy, rest in peace, Judy, I still think we did a, a great job smacking up that Pokemon League, and can we please get a round of applause for Sauron and Julian, both back to back, you know, like, they imagine them back to back. Like Houndoom chilling, tentacle with his uh Julian with his tentacles. <laughs> um, but hats off to them. Um, the rest of the squad did their thing to Winnie, Ramla, cashing in that bank, Ramla whooping that other imposter crowbat, uh, and Xavier holding it down. <sighs> like I said in the last episode, yes, we are going to continue on to Kanto. Um, a lot of people ask. Are you gonna are you gonna continue after you beat the Pokemon League? Like I get it, you know, I guess the credits are playing, so technically you beat the game. Um, but in my opinion, you didn't beat the game until you beat Red. So freak yes, we're gonna continue on. Um, so tomorrow night I will be here <laughs> with you guys ready to continue on. But I do wanna thank you guys so so much for your support throughout not just late night yellow. Um, but Late Night Crystal as well. Maybe I should have said that backwards. Just through the Late Night series, just in general, so far. Um, shout the fuck out to you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. But, I think for right now, we're gonna go ahead and wrap up here for tonight. <laughs> if you guys enjoyed tonight's hour of chill, and of course, if you'd like to show your support of the Prime and the Nappy Nation, Make sure to like button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. Um, oh, I should have mentioned this at the start of the video. I forgot. Shopnappy.com. The crack theme is available as long as the crack deadlock is going. And the Halloween Spook 2022 is running through November 5th. So if you like the purple and orange, snag it before November 5th because then it's gone. Anyways, enough of that. Until next time, once again, thank you so much for your support, and thank you for your love and light. I'm out this bitch. Or, be safe. I'm out this bitch. Bye.